All right, so what we have here is a list of linear equations, and we're just going to solve these. So starting off with number 5, and we'll go through 14 here. So we just subtract 7 first. So if we subtract 7, we end up with minus 7. We have 2x is equal to 26, 26. No, that's going to be 24. Divided by 2, x is equal to 13. So what about number 7? Add 8, multiply by 2, we end up with x is equal to 18. So if you plug 18 back in here, you get 18 times a half, which is 9 minus 8, equals 1. So here, we add 2w, we get negative 5w equals 15. Divide through by negative 5, we get x, excuse me, x, we get w is equal to negative 3. All right, starting here, subtract one half from one third, and one half from one third. So that's going to be equal to two sixth minus three sixth. So negative one third. So negative one third is equal to negative two. Divide through by negative one third. We get um, y is equal to six. Positive six. All right, so for this one, distribute the 2. So we get 2 minus 2x is equal to 3 plus 6x plus 5. So we add 2x to both sides. Combine the, uh, the, all the constants. So we get 8, and then it's 2 minus 8 is negative 6. We get... ...4. We're going to end up with x is equal to negative... 3 over 4. Ha! Huh. Alright, so for here, 2 thirds. So we just, I'm doing all the odd ones right now. Um, distribute this. So 2 thirds y plus 1 half y minus 3 halves equals y plus 1 over 4. Common denominator is going to be 6. Looks like 12. It could be other ones, but we'll use 12. So we get um, 8y plus. 6y minus 6, 18 plus 3y plus, because what happens here is you multiply by 12, divided by 4, you multiply 3 across the top, and this should be equals. So we end up with 14y minus 18 equals 3y plus 3, add 18 to both sides. So we end up with 11y equals 22 divided by 11, y equals 2. So what about um, starting with these? All we're going to do is add 3 to both sides. 5x equals 7 divide through by 5, x equals 7 over 5. Subtract 3, 1 third x equals Five or is equal to eight three by one third x equals twenty four. Next up, same principle. Add five t to both sides. T is equal to five over two. Common denominator of 10, so we end up with 2z equals 3z plus 70. z is equal to negative 70. Subtract 3c from the 2z. Negative z equals 70. Divide through by negative 1z equals 70. All right, hopefully this helped you out with some equations we can solve. And I will see you in the next video.